Boss, you're late for the shoot. I'm sorry. I was finishing up some work for National Brisket Day. And I really need to talk to Jimmy Ho from Instagram. He knows all about this kind of stuff. I really need to meet him someday. Tell me you didn't read the briefing memo without telling me you didn't read the briefing memo. Anyways, our guest is in the studio, so it's time to figure out how to do this interview. Wait, Jimmy Ho's here today? Uh, May 23rd is National Brisket Day. A great day. What's not to love? Fire, smoke, meat, it's all there. It might surprise you to learn, even someone who works at TWC might need some upskilling too. I've been working on different techniques, but I haven't been able to perfect the bark on my brisket. So I thought I would invite someone with more experience to give me a few pointers. It's so nice to have Jimmy Ho, also known as the Smoking Ho, here to talk brisket. How's it going, Jimmy? Oh, sorry I'm late, uh, I was looking for our dog. Name brisket. Oh, brisket. Oh, this is starting to make so much more sense now. I was I was getting really worried about how this interview was going to go. Jimmy, it's, it's good to see you. You know, I was thinking maybe we could turn this interview into a podcast. Um, I don't. Now, look, 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 it'll be amazing. All right, we can talk about the workforce the way we talk about barbecue, like it's a process. You know, like, um, I mean, like, like I've got some notes here. You know, each part needs different support, just like each meat needs its own temperature. I, I mean, like, like, what do you think? Okay, but, but if you think about it, barbecue by nature is an apprenticeable sort of profession, right? The, 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 the pit master can teach the others how to do it. I mean, it, it's like each meat needs its own attention. You need to know exactly when to pull it out. It, it's, a, it's a whole thing, right? Oh no, I think brisket needs to go out. I gotta take him out. Okay, all right. I still think I'm on to something with that podcast. I can't help but think of workforce issues no matter what I'm doing. We're always thinking of ways to help employers and job seekers with innovative ways to upskill and reskill. Now maybe we don't have a brisket apprenticeship yet or a podcast to talk about it, but we do have a lot of other programs here at TWC. And who's to say we couldn't get that brisket apprenticeship too? Apprenticeship Texas offers options for a lot of different apprenticeship models, plus the Skills Development Fund and Upskill Texas support upskilling employees to meet the needs of Texas employers. I may not be able to provide a lot of tips on your briskets, but if you need training or upskilling for your workforce, you should just let us know. As always, thanks for watching. I hope you have a great day.